The fastest camera car in the world is an R3 two million lamb two million dollar lamborghini hurricane that can film at over 290 kilometers an hour oh camera car i get it it's like what's he talking about so does it have the big like the whole rig on the top as well what what that doesn't even look real man because it because the camera looks like one of those miniature cameras except enormous in this case obviously oh my god God. That looks so cool. That is cool. It's like a full out 360 degree camera, motorized, pan tilt. It looks so heavy. It's amazing the car can remain balanced and travel at those speeds. Look at this. It's on a Lamborghini. Like that, you wouldn't. Think well, it would have to be, right? If you're chasing around race cars. Well, it could be a different race car. Oh, what, like it could be Ferrari. It could be. Oh, Ford. sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I th- but why I'm were just you saying so surprised? That profile. It's so. I just the Lamborghini is so low. Like I don't know. I just figure there might be a better option out there. Maybe that is the best. Maybe that is what they were looking for. Well, you need something with a high top speed. I mean, you just saw the Hurricane uh, with the camera equipment traveling up to 290 kilometers an hour. Right? Is that I, what it said? Yeah, I'm just saying. Is that what it said? Will 290. Go back up. Let's just kilometers. verify this. I want to make sure I got it right. Yeah, yeah. 290 kilometers an hour. But any car that's chasing can obviously do the same speed. I mean, if it's following it, right? So Correct. A- anyway, it, it looks amazing, though. So maybe they did a lot of research on what car <laughs> it was going to be. Because you're still not spending three, four $400,000 on that vehicle, right? Anyway, it's... You you want it's, them to put it on a no, cheaper car? No, I don't want them to do anything. I'm just saying um, they, they must have took some time to pick that car not just based oh, on I speed. know why I know why they picked it why because the car is called the Lamborghini Huracan and then they can call this one the Lamborghini Huracan oh can't yeah okay got it <laughs> yeah, That's pretty good. of course That's pretty good. it's in the description yeah, underneath yeah, yeah. the picture there yeah, the yeah, world's yeah. most powerful. I don't, those guys, I don't know. I'm no, just, I think you, there's just, legitimacy there. No, I think I'm just sense. saying, I don't know, man. Uh, the, it must be really fun to drive. The Huracam too. is Active Films, a United States company uh, there who operate it. Work out of Sacramento, California, established in 2011. It lists itself as one of the leading car media outlets in the U.S., According to Transportation Insider, there are other vehicles fitted with cameras that operate via gyro stabilized rig. However, the Italian supercar is the fastest of its kind in the world. That's amazing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm I'm definitely into that. I mean, who knows? Maybe that vehicle has been used in some of your favorite sequences and you wouldn't even know. Yeah. Car chase scenes right. and races and so forth. It would be a cool camera angle in F1, but there's no, you couldn't obviously do that. Mm-hmm. No, obviously, maybe the the um, safety car could it? Could maybe we, could we get the safety <laughs> car view? I mean, <laughs> it's be so unnecessary. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> uh, it's in the front. I guess it could be facing back. Uh, that's a lot of work uh-huh. for one camera angle. You got cameras everywhere, anyways. You got cameras. You got co- in the cockpit, so. And they're decent quality nowadays. Yeah, I know. You don't need such a big camera in a lot of cases, but this one, they want such beautiful stabilization with the... Yeah, yeah. I get it. Yeah, I know the safety car already has cameras. That just I'm just saying, like, have a rig to that extent. Sure. Quite a 